Voices of the Valiant Youth, the fourth annual production, of course. Every year they theme it differently. And so um, it's going to be a wonderful production. We're getting to know the cast behind, of course, the cast of performers behind this spectacular production. Another one is here. He is Teddy D. Frederick. I'm very particular about that. Now, he gave me some business card just recently, and I saw on it, artist and creative director. I normally refer to you as the renaissance man yeah. in the creative industry. Teddy, your association with this event, why? Because the people behind this event, they're my family, in the sense that, you know, they're all artists in their own right, and I like to associate myself with people who are artistically inclined in that regard. So, I just kind of want to be around the arts. Right. And when I'm around the arts, I feel like I'm at home. So, this is basically my association. Right. Yeah. Now, you have dabbled in so many areas that it's very hard to pinpoint, okay, this is your specific niche because you do so much but for that mm. particular production on the on you know on the day you have to narrow it down yes. to something yes. so what have you decided as your performance well for me um i've been writing for a while um however i wasn't um exposing my writing so when i came into the contact with the writers association it gave me an opportunity to really expand my writing and to really you know, explore more in depth in terms of what my writing could become. And, you know, just being around these people and getting that kind of vibe and that rhythm, you know, I was able to start getting more creative and more artistic with my writing. And, you know, writing for me then became not something that I can put up on display for others to look at, but became like my silent kind of art, you know, because I'm involved in the photography and the, to the arts, the painting, the film work, but in writing, you know, that was just like my thing. And I realized, you know, just being around these people that, you know, you can verbalize or you can um, portray some of your work out there and just have it out there for people to, you know, to see. Just the same as any other thing with your paintings or anything. And I just wanted to do that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So in, in, in looking into your, your performance um, at the event when the day comes, um, help us to get an appreciation for it. I mean what format would it take? I'm still, I'm still trying to you know, come up with an idea for a pinpoint like what exactly it is that I'm going to do but generally it's going to center around poetry, mm -hmm. right? I, I like poetry. I have an appreciation for you know, the, the poetic arts but for this time around uh, voices I want to do something more interesting. I want to do something different uh, so I want to do poetry but I'm not going to do poetry in the sense that um, I kind of want to put my work out there but then I want to perform my work so I want to mix in um, some of my miming with my poetry and I just kind of want to bring that across oh okay yeah. oh a multiplicity of sorts yeah hmm, interesting right so um and in in terms of Teddy the young man in terms of what you offer as a performer I mean what do you think is your draw to audiences when, when you perform? Because th th there's something about your personality which resonates mm. with people. How goes on is that? <laughs> I don't know. Um, it's really hard to say because, you know, um, to be honest, I'm, I'm just doing what I like and I'm just exercise exercising that passion. You know, I'm just being involved in the environment with people and I'm just doing what it is that I know what to do best. And some people are drawn to that and Others, they, they're not sure and they just kind of come around to kind of figure out what's going on and I'm, I'm okay with that, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, I just want to do what, it, what I like to do and just do it well. Because mm -hmm. if you're going to do it, you might as well just do it well. Yeah. Whose energy do you rely on as a performer? Yours, the audience or both? I, I think more for me, it's, it's, it's personal. A lot of things that I do in terms of the art, it's personal. I want to um, see for myself what it is that I can achieve and if I'm going to do it then achieve it to the best of my ability so I set the criteria for what I'm going to do and I would know if it's done right um, regardless if somebody says hey Teddy you've done a good job you know the critic from the, the audience is okay but you know internalizing um, I would know whether or not it's good or not because I've set my criteria and I know what I'm looking for so I know when it's good and when it's not good mm -hmm. yes well, you're in touch with yourself. Yeah. No doubt. Okay, so why must we come see you perform? Teddy D. Frederick. 
Well, you can come to the show, uh, the Voices of Valiant Youth. So basically, to see everyone, you know, to see all the different talents, to see all the diversities, to see all the different variations in poetry and in writing. Um, voices, you know, um, my, my first time last year being with the, 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 the group, um, I've known about it from since the inception, but I wasn't around the first time and I've traveled and then the second time I wasn't there again. But this time, I'm definitely here. And um, you know, you could just come out and just see talent, man. Um, I believe that Grenada has, you know, is ha has a lot of unique personalities out there, and you know, they just need a platform to exercise that. And once given that platform, you can see a lot of things coming from that. And coming to voices is um, is an example of that, I believe. Okay. Yeah. Look forward to your performance. You're doing a bit of poetry along with some other creative expressions. Yes. But no doubt that that, that personality of yours uh, <laughs> is going to yeah. strike out okay. in your performance because, yeah. in, in my view, it, it has become your signature. Mm. Yeah? All right. Wish you the very best. Can you hear the call?